Thanks. <laughs> and to think the last time I saw you, I said you didn't have the guts to kill anyone. Proving once again what a lousy judge of character you really are. Would it help if I said I was wrong? Help what? Oh, wait a minute now. If you're looking for an exclusive interview, forget hey, it. Hey, look, you're the guy laying here with a bullet hole and I'm facing life in prison, Kirk. You can't afford arrogance. Fortunately, Emily, that's one thing I can still easily afford. I need some information. And I should give it to you because... Because it's going to help you. About the other night when you were shot. Oh, now, there's a scoop. Unfortunately, I know I was shot. How's that going to help Did me? you see anything? Maybe did you see who shot you? Cops, I guess. Well, then you'd guess wrong. What? It wasn't a cop that shot you. It was someone else. And I'm going to track them down. Come on, what's the big rush? Just let me take a look at the job, Mark, you know what that means. I don't have time to sit here and chat no, about it. We're not Let's sitting go. here chatting. We're yelling. Come what? on, let me what's look at it. What's going on here? She's got, Phil's got a work order to tear down the treehouse. <sighs> Molly, glad you could make it. All the talk shows were reruns this morning, so I figured I wouldn't be missing anything. <laughs> Hi, Miss Griffin. Uh, it's Jessica. Now, uh, Lily told me that you spoke yesterday, so you're all set, right? Ready as I'll ever be. Not quite. Oh, you picked up my dry cleaner. Uh, no. How sweet. <laughs> Not really. Oh, Lily. Yeah, I, I kind of guessed on the size. I think it'll be all right, though. Wait a minute. You bought this just for today? Are you kidding? You're going to need something when you get out, when you get a job. <laughs> Lily, this is so... wow. <laughs> you know, I'd almost be fooled if I saw me in this. We're not trying to fool anyone. We don't have to. She's gonna need some place to change. I'll take her to the ladies' room. Hurry up. It's time we got you out of here. Darling! Darling! You shouldn't leave the door open! I did that. I was just bringing this in. It's a new bed for Luke. Hi. Hi. Where is she? At the courthouse. Oh, my God. What's happened now? Uh, relax. She's just helping that friend of hers from prison. Her bail hearing is today. You would think that that child had had enough of courthouses to last her a lifetime. <laughs> well, I don't think she's planning many more visits there. Good. So she's po posting bail for the newfound best friend? Is that what she's doing? Yeah. yeah, she really likes this girl. She says she didn't do anything wrong. It was her boyfriend. Oh, her boyfriend. The one-armed bandit. Her boyfriend. The drug lord from Colombia. <laughs> uh-huh. You think Lily's really that stupid? No. Lily isn't stupid at all. She's just too trusting. You know what I mean? Anybody with a, a story gets her attention. And with her attention, her money. <laughs> I don't think that this bail is going to break Lily's bank. Well, it's not in my business, but it's not going to be just the bail. There's going to be a loan next and who knows what. Man, you are on a tear today. I'm sorry. I just think that Lily should be more careful with herself after all that's happened. You know what I'm talking about. There are people out there. There are people out there who could use her. Yeah, people. People who want to get into the mansion. People who want to get her money. Yeah, Like yeah. me. No. You used to talk about me the same Not way. Like you. That was before, before we understood each other. Oh, but it's different now. Yes. You never trust anybody, Lucinda. So I got to wonder, are you going to turn on me again? Oh. the world turns brought to you today by love's new stretch diapers great on leaks at a great low price live and learn and then get loves as soon as your baby rolls over you rush out and buy the walker the jumpy thing the expensive stretch diapers but then you realize what you should have bought was a leash and these new stretch diapers from Love's with stretchy sides to help stop those little gaps. And when your kids get wild, Love's work great on leaks. So great, it's hard to believe they cost less than other brands. Every day without coupons. With the money you save, go out to dinner. Let someone else chase your kids. Hey, live and learn. And then get Love's. New Love's Stretch. 
Does your tissue leave you with a problem on your hands? He blows his nose, he goes right through the tissue, and his hands get all wet. And so's the ball. And everyone else's hands. That's why there's Puff's Advanced Extra Strength, the tissue that keeps hands cleaner and drier than regular tissue. Drier is definitely better. Puff's Advanced is 60% thicker. It's thicker. They really are soft. This should protect their hands, and I'll protect the azaleas. Puff's Advanced Extra Strength, the best ones to protect your loved ones. Because hardworking, reheated, forgotten about pots and pans everywhere need all the help they can get, there's Dawn. Dawn cuts tough grease better than any other liquid, even on pots and pans. Dawn takes grease out of your way. The Vidal Sassoon Academy with news you can use. If your hair does this, it's damaged. Vidal Sassoon conditioners have protein and moisturizers that work to reduce split ends and breakage to help you have this. Sassoon hair, perfect from beginning to end. Just can't believe that you mm, that you said that to me, darling. It's a legitimate question, considering. Considering what? Lily and I, we're seeing each other again. Oh, good. I think that is wonderful. Well, we're going to take it very slow. She needs to sort some things out. Yeah, and you're going to be there. You'll be with her when she's doing it all the time. Here? Living with her? No, I won't be living here. Why not? Well, it's like I said, we're taking things slow. So you'll have plenty of time to try and break us up if you want. Oh, darling, I really, I really did think that we had arrived at a different place. Well, I thought we had. Then, yeah, well, then how can you say that I wouldn't want to break you up? Because you come in here spouting opinions about the door, about Lily and her friends. Why should I think you're in a different place? Because of all that we lived through together, for heaven's sake. You think I'm going to forget what happened to us? I'm eternally grateful to you. Well, maybe you wouldn't mean to. But, you know, things happen. Priorities change. Priority, yeah. First priority of every living being is to stay alive. <laughs> huh. Um, Holden, um, you know something? Uh, You're not making this easy for me. What? <sighs> There's something I want to ask of you. It's an offer, really. I knew it. Knew what? It's only a matter of time. Would you just let me speak my piece? What, you're going to offer me a bundle of cash or maybe my own horse training farm as far away from Oakdale as possible? I'd like you to think about signing on again at Worldwide. You're serious? Yes, I'm serious. Still trying to clean me up, huh? Mm-mm, no. I need you. I need someone that I can trust. I was lousy at it, Lucinda. No, darling, actually, you weren't. You didn't give yourself credit for what you were able to do. I never liked it. Well, that's something else. But you might, you could, possibly, if, if you had different challenges. I wasn't very good at taking orders, if you recall. Oh, well, maybe this time you should be giving a few orders. What are you talking about? Well, I mean, maybe you should be there in a managerial, in an in a overseeing capacity. <laughs> Isn't that what you do? I... I can't do it all myself. Yeah, but that's what you do. That's your job. Well, anyway, I don't want to. I mean, maybe there are other things that I want to do. Maybe I want to spend my time a different way. You know, I've got all those art genes floating around inside of me, and I made a vow to myself in the cellar with you that when it came to work, I was, I was going to have a sense of humor and maybe take things a little easier. Listen, I'm getting plenty of work here training horses. That's okay. You can do that as well. You can be a gentleman trainer. I'm very flexible. Why are you so intent on getting me back into Worldwide? Darling, I have nobody I like. I have nobody I can trust. Would you think about it at least? So let me get this straight. You're happy that I'm seeing Lily again. You seem disappointed that I'm not living here, and you're going to turn your company over to me. Mm. What are you up to, Lucinda? She's nice, isn't she? Well, I suppose. Uh, well, she's mostly giving me attitude, Lily. You know, I, it's normal, so I expect it. Well, she thinks that's all she's got. Well, you talked to her about that, right? I mean, so she's going to check it at the door? Yeah, yeah, I think she's got it. She's a, she's a nice person. She really is. She's a really good person inside. I... And, wow, gorgeous. 
<laughs> you look great. That is perfect on you. Well, you see, I got my own personal shopper who's got great taste. Well, you're gonna have to give me your name. <laughs> <laughs> uh, can we have a few minutes alone to talk? Sure. They're not going anywhere. We'll be outside. Did you get any sleep last night? <sighs> not much. Nervousness or noise? Oh, I think probably both. It's gonna be okay. It'll be a breeze. If the judge asks you any questions, just be honest. Unless I honestly want to tell him off. Yeah, right. It's just going to be a few minutes. Just sit there for a few minutes and be cool, look good and responsible, and we'll be on our way to lunch before you know it. You're already posting bail. You don't have to feed me, too. Oh, I see. I'm good enough for you in jail, but once you get out of here, you'll forget all about me. <laughs> Lily, I'm never going to be able to thank you enough. Yes, you will. You get through this and get out of here. That's thanks enough for me. I'll try. I'll really try. What are you talking about? The cops had to have done it. No, well, they couldn't have. Why not? Because they investigated. None of the cops fired their guns that night. Well, maybe not their registered guns, but maybe they had backups and ankle holsters, something like that? Not unless they were 17 feet tall. It was a rifle, Kirk. The bullet they dug out of you was from a rifle shot from the stables. And you think I know who it was? That doesn't hurt to ask. No, you're right, it doesn't. You want to hear my theory? Yeah. I think it was Diego's real killer. What? All that stuff I what? said was just to impress Sam. You are beyond belief. Exactly. I was out of my mind thinking that, that Sam didn't love me anymore and I'd say anything to get her back. You had Margot's gun. Ballistics confirmed that it was the murder weapon. Lucky break, my finding it, huh? <gasps> Who the hell is going to believe that? A court of law. Who's going to testify against me, Emily? Margot? We all love Margot, but we know she's a little... Oh, you scum. I am a good judge of character. Even if you did have the guts to pull the trigger, you don't have the guts to take the responsibility. Nobody is going to do time for killing Diego. Nobody should. It was a public service. Well, you're right. Nobody should do time, not for that. But you, my friend, are going to jail unless you get some help. I'm here to offer you a deal. The morning begins at sleepy pace. Coffee telling you not to race. Breakfast when something new. Clouds and grown aroma coming through. Where is he? I better go check. Folgers Coffee House Breakfast Blend. A new variety of mountain-grown aroma and flavor. Amazingly smooth yet full-bodied. A taste of unhurried times. I better go check. The best part of waking up Folgers in your car. I better go check. As a receptionist here, I can tell you that in this office, if you haven't been using the right toothpaste, the dentist lets you know it. Wrong toothpaste? When he goes like this, it means you've got a tartar problem. But this? Mm -hmm means you've been brushing with Crest Tartar Control. Tartar forms especially at the gum line, and regular toothpaste can't block that tartar. But Crest has patented tartar blockers that help reduce visible tartar buildup. How'd it go? Mm. Yeah. The dentist's choice is Crest Protection. Imagine life without allergies. It's simple, because new Nasal Crom Allergy Controller is now available without a prescription. Nasal Crom doesn't just treat your nasal allergy symptoms, it helps prevent them. You see, it builds a protective barrier to stop the allergic reaction before it starts. And Nasal Crom won't make you drowsy. Don't just treat your allergy symptoms, prevent them. With new Nasal Crom, keep allergies away. With new Nasal Crom spray. We take different steps. We have our own rules. Babe, we break our own rules. We have different tastes. We sing our own songs. We keep different secrets. Some of us like things sweet. We may be different, we may be different, but we're all We may be different, but we're all equal. The world's a germy place. That's why you need Dial. Dial gets rid of the dirt you see and kills the germs you can't see. Over the years, Dial has killed more germs than any other soap. So at the end of the day, aren't you glad you use Dial? Tonight on The Late Show, Roseanne, Rockin' Chuck Berry, and an audience from St. Louis. We hear it's gonna be great. By the way, feel free to use me as a reference. Tonight on CBS.
Milltown, 125 to 127 Elm Street, two adjacent lots. Yes, but... Treehouse and any other existing structures. This is definitely it, folks. Well, it, okay, it's supposed to be a garden. A garden? Right. He promised us, David Allen said he would intervene. Hey, let me take a look at the war curtain. Come on, Phil, it's not state it's secrets. It's, it's going to be public record anyways. Yeah, the deed may be, but I've never had a boss who's let me publish work plans. Well, just let me see who signed off on it. Come yeah, on. honey, then we can take it to City Hall and get us a deed. Lady, this land here is zoned. City Hall cannot do anything about it. Well, you know what? The district attorney's office sure can. What are you talking about? I'm talking about the district attorney, David Allen. He is the one that convinced the city council to make this into a garden instead. <laughs> okay. Well, the city council may want a garden here, but my boss wants duplexes. Okay. Who's your boss? Green Street Corporation. They want housing for the employees at their new plant. What? Yeah. I think it's a nice idea. Wait, wait, wait a minute. You tell me that this isn't city property? That's right. You sure? I'm positive. I wouldn't be here without a permit. You know he, that, He Mark. made it up. Alan made up the whole thing. Are you sure? Let yes, lady, I am sure. I don't know anything about the city, district attorneys, or gardens. All I know is this is private property. You need a lot of help here, Kirk. And a sympathetic press could go a long way with getting you a lenient hearing. In exchange for? And if a paper could chase after this unknown gunman who shot you? In exchange for? Well, they could certainly make it look like they were the real killer, afraid that you were going to expose them if you were taken into custody. What's it going to cost, Emily? Nothing. Good. Because that's exactly what I can afford. Come on, enough wind up here. Give me the pitch. I, I, I can't make a deal if I don't know what's on the table. It's not going to cost you anything. It's exactly what you want, Kirk. What you've always wanted anyway. Samantha? Ugh, you numbskull! Sam betrayed you. Or didn't you notice that in the midst of all the shooting? Sam set you up. And why, Kirk? Huh? Who brought her back? Who used her to put you in jail? Lucinda. <sighs> I should have known. You're afraid she's going to take your little toy away. No! Huh? No, that's just it. She's been threatening me, making all kinds of noise, how she's going to take me to court to take the city times away from me, and then all of a sudden, nothing? Just quiet? You have good reason to be nervous. Hmm, she seems distracted. I think it's a front to throw me off. Emily, I can't believe I'm saying this, but I'm not a problem for you anymore. <sighs> Kirk, you are the only person who knows how and why Lucinda turned that paper over to me. And without you, it's her word against my word and an ironclad contract. Lucinda's not going to use my testimony. Not again. Not after she suckered me in the past uh, by promising to help me and... What am I thinking? I have no idea. Lucinda will promise you Sam and money and a new job and who knows what else. But remember, Kirk, none of that means anything if you're in jail. And Lucinda can't get you out of jail, no matter what she tells you. You never forget that. She wants you behind bars. So it looks like I'm the only one here who can offer you any help. For a price. Yeah. You get to stand around and watch Lucinda lose for once in her bossy, miserable life. Yeah. It's a heavy burden. But for you, old friend... <laughs> <laughs> only friend, Kirk. Only friend. Except for that guy who tried to shoot me. I mean, he might be my ticket out of this whole thing. You're sure the cops didn't do it? <sighs> Positive. Then who? Why are you so cute <laughs> when you disapprove of me? <laughs> Things really didn't work out worldwide the way that we planned last time. That was ancient history. Everything has changed now. No, nothing has changed. I'm still a guy who wants to train horses, not run a business. But you... You still love Lily. That's constant. Yes, I do. Yeah. And you want to be with her? Well, that's up to her. And she will not let you stop us this time. And neither will I. Oh, why does everybody refuse to let me change when I want to? You can do whatever you want. As long as it's your own life. Okay. I suppose I deserve everything that bad that happens to me. By the way, I, I, I was unfair to you. Unfair? Yeah. Huh. I was, and I was wrong. Everything I said in the... And the wine cellar was correct. You're a good guy. You're a decent, loyal, good man. Yeah, yeah, I was the son that you never had, what right? What are you talking about? It was a joke. <sighs> yeah, I'm not nice that often. Don't make it into some kind of big chore. Okay, all right. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. 
Hey, you know, what I was saying is true about you. You are right. You're the you're a good, decent guy, and you're the right guy for Lily. Like I said, that's up to Lily. And I can count on you, too, can I? I can count on you. You'll, you'll protect her. Lily does not need any protecting. Lily always needs protecting. From what? She needs protecting from the things that she gets herself into, from the kinds of people that flock to her all of time. That's what she needs. What kinds of people? Or do you have anybody special in mind, or does this have to do with what happened with Diego? Diego is dead, darling. I don't have to worry about him. It's what's going to happen next. What happens next? There's something here that you're not telling me. This is good. Who made this? I did. You spent all day baking this. No. Hold on. This peanut butter filling? I made it. This chocolate shell? I made it. This cookie crumb crust? That's mine. So then you did bake it? No. Introducing Jell-O No Bake Peanut Butter Cup. You make it, you don't bake it. So you did not bake this, right? Right. Okay. So then who made it? I did. New Jell-O No Bake. Make one tonight. Introducing new Lever 2000 Pure Rain Deodorant Soap. The cool deodorant scent is so invigorating, you can't wait to get close. And new Pure Rain has moisturizers for fresh feeling skin that makes you want to stay close. And nothing's more invigorating than that. New Lever 2000 Pure Rain, the refreshing clean for all your 2000 parts. Dr. Scholl's Odor Destroyers, with 50% more odor-destroying power than Odor Eater's foot powder. So try Dr. Scholl's. The crab boats are out, and Red Lobster's there, to capture sweet snow crab and steam it with care. A dinner from scratch, crab at its prime, and now a pound's just $9.99. Red Lobster, prepared so fresh, you can taste it. Phyllis thought she kissed her problem goodbye. Take this $20,000 and go get a new life for yourself. But hello, trouble. It's time to up the ante, Phyllis. The worst is yet to come. This is extortion, Sasha. Oh, girl, didn't Mama ever teach you? I'd have killed you right now. Always watch your back. Bonuses on Wall Street. They're the biggest ever. Feeding off the Wall Street boom tonight. The role of David Allen is now being played by Daniel Markell. I thought you always ate at your desk. Well, I guess I just felt the walls closing in on me today. Mind if I join you? <clears throat> Don't start. Relax. I promise you're safe. I'll never say you're attractive again. Heed my warning. Good. Can I get you anything? Mimosa? Bloody Mary? Club soda? Lime? Oh, beautiful. It's business with Miss Stewart. <clears throat> hey, tough. Deny everything. Are employees supposed to fraternize with the patrons? Club soda, ma'am. Lime. So, Mr. Assistant DA? No comment, Miss Stewart. I haven't asked you anything yet. Boy, what are you so touchy about? You've got Diego's killer. You should be happy. I am. I am very happy. <laughs> you don't look happy. So what could be bothering you in the midst of all of this good news? Oh, could it be because you don't have the guy who shot Kirk Anderson? Internal Affairs is working on it right now. You mean worked on it. They investigated. None of the cops fired the gun. Well, you have better sources than I do. Yeah, and I got that one from the district attorney's office. That's worrisome. So what are you worried about? Me or the shooter? Look, there's somebody out there who nearly killed Kirk Anderson. Doesn't that concern you? I prosecute, Emily. Hear me on this, okay? The police investigate. Without a suspect, I have nothing to do. So why don't you go talk to Helmonson about this? Oh, I intend to. <clears throat> I also heard from my source that uh, the ballistics on the bullet they pulled from Kirk was very interesting. Still no oh, comment. Emily, Emily, what an annoying little hobby you've taken up. There's a story here, David. Whether you care about it or not, I'm going to get to the bottom of it. <laughs> not if I can help it. Morning. Morning, Your Honor. Sorry to keep you all waiting. Mrs. Grimaldi, I, uh... Lily, it's good to see you. I think. 
Why am I seeing you? I'm here with Miss Cullen. Oh. Well, sit down. <clears throat> Good morning, Your Honor. Good morning, and who are you? Valerie Medades from the District Attorney's Office. Uh -huh. David Allen asked me to cover for him. He asked for this hearing himself. Where is he? He was involved in the apprehension of Kirk Anderson. So I... Got it. He's... Got it. Got it. Yes, I plan to be in Bimini when that one goes to the docket. Okay, I have reviewed the record. Uh, when the defendant was arraigned, she was not able to make bail. What's changed? Mrs. Grimaldi has volunteered to post the bond while Miss Collin awaits trial. That's true? Yes. I'll post bond and complete bail, whatever's necessary. What about flight risk? Your office objected to bail before on those grounds. Our objection stands. Miss Conlon is indigent. She was unemployed when she was arrested, has no ties to the community that we could find. She has a history of encounters with the law. Where's the rap sheet? These were minor infractions, Your Honor. Right. Traffic tickets. She's talking to me, Your Honor. Can I say something? Yeah, you can sit down, Miss Meredith. Go ahead. I know Molly's not going to run. I know she's looking forward to trial and proving her innocence. Uh, no offense, Mrs. Grimaldi, but most defendants will say that. And as the days get closer and closer, the road starts to look a lot better than a courtroom. Not this defendant. Mrs. Grimaldi. Lily, how well do you know this woman? She's my friend. You met in jail, I take it? Does it matter where we met? There's a lot of innocent people in jail. But we already know that, don't we, Your Honor? Excuse me, Your Honor. I, um, I know you think that I'm going to run, but... But I can tell you that I wouldn't do that to look Mrs. Grimaldi. She's been real decent to put up bail and to give me a second chance, and I won't let her down. I don't know if your gratitude is going to be sufficient collateral. Y your Honor, uh, I will offer to let Miss Conlon stay with me at my home and vouch for her appearance at a trial. No, no, I can't do that. Emily, it is not that I don't care. I am just not in favor of citizens acting as vigilantes. Even if they help you solve the case? Is that why you're so relaxed about finding the gunman, David? No. Miss Stewart, you have completely ruined any possibility of relaxation today. Thank you. I'm just trying to have a lunch break here. Okay, fine. So what about when you go back to your office? <sighs> I will do everything I can to impress taxpayers like you who pay my salary. And does that include finding the guy who saved your tail? All right, listen to me here. Whoever shot Kirk Anderson endangered people's lives. I am not happy about that. And nor did they take anyone off my tail, as you put it. But what they did is they put themselves in the middle of a hostage situation without knowing what they were doing. Now, when they find the gunman, I will do everything I can with every all my resources in the office to get this guy. Wow. You're real good at that, aren't you, Alan? Come on, Mark, it's not worth it. Did you, did, did you actually think that we wouldn't find out? Find out what? Your scam. All that sincere help you gave us from the goodness of your heart. The private company that owns a property next door is there demolishing the treehouse right now. Why, David, what were you trying to prove? Oh, because I, I'm a killer. I'm a killer, right? And then if you couldn't prove that, then maybe you could worm your way into my life and get my fiancé to think you're a real nice guy. So she'll believe you when you run me down. Was that it? Huh? Excuse me, people. Oh, come on, Mark, Alan. Come on. Mark, come on. You've been on. dying to talk to me for weeks. You've been following me around. You snoop into my past. You jump in the middle of my private life. You wanted my attention, you got it. Come on, Mark, let's go. Does it feel good? You know what? Get out of my face. OK, it's a pleasure. Max. He lives for adventure. Taming wild animals, sailing the high seas. He's one easygoing guy, all right. Thanks to Carnation Good Start, the routine formula designed to help avoid common feeding problems like fussiness, crying, and gas. Because only Good Start's protein is specially processed into smaller pieces to be extra gentle. And that can leave this tiger feeling real comfortable. Bring out the very best in your baby with Carnation Good Start from Nestle. It's the softest bath tissue you'll touch. It's Kleenex Cottonelle Ultra Soft. With 24% more cottony soft fibers than the leading premium brand. So much more. It makes a difference you can see for a softness you can feel.
Pamper yourself and your family like never before with luxurious Kleenex Cottonelle Ultra Soft. Feel what the softest feels like. Here comes the Boss Bravo 2 Boss 10 Amps. Tough on dirt, not your budget. Boss Plus 12 powerful amps, the most you can buy for deep down cleaning. With Micron Filter System, clean above floor. Put the Boss to work for less than you expected. Boss and Boss Plus from Eureka. Sound the alarm. <laughs> America's number one selling video is now on sale everywhere. Is this true? Don't miss your chance to own the biggest Disney movie of the year. It's the video your family will love. Glenn Close, Disney's 101 Dalmatians. We'll continue with part two of As the World Turns in just a moment. From the Wendy City to the great outdoors, to your own hometown, when you least expect it. Y'all didn't know they was closing the state of Texas today? The whole state? From sea to smiling sea, it's an all-you-candid camera across America. Then, the incredible, the phenomenal, ordinary extraordinary, CBS Tonight. Oh, man. It's back, California's best home remodeling and decorating show, May 2nd through 4th. No longer at Anaheim Convention Center. We move to the Orange County Fairgrounds. Kitchens, floors, windows, doors, everything from roofs to rose gardens. Plus, do-it-yourself workshops in the all-new Dream Backyard. Endorsed by the League of California Homeowners this week at Orange County Fairgrounds. Albertsons is here at the Grand Canyon to introduce new Charmin Triple Roll. So, how long is it? Albertsons knows it's three times longer than a single roll. Three times longer. That's over a hundred feet longer than a double roll. No other bath tissue lasts longer and is so soft. It's a great combination of softness and length. Get new Charmin Triple Roll from Albertsons. It's three times longer and it still fits. What's in your ice cream? Polly Shore Mono 80. All the stuff that a first grader like me cannot read. Now check out Briars in the Black Pack. Only milk, cream, sugar, and vanilla. Yum. This is the right ice cream. Briars All Natural. Taste, not technology. When you blend Hershey's chocolate with almonds with a special creamy recipe of Briars ice cream, what do you get? Briars Blends. Ice cream that's loaded. Testing antibacterial products tonight on CBS 2 News. CBS. Welcome home. And now part two of As the World Turns. Come on, let's go, come on. Hey, son of a... Oh, 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 Come on, please, let's go. Please. Stay out of my life, Alan, all right? Enough. <sighs> See ya, you better get some ice on there. Are you okay? Oh, yeah, all right. What was that all about? Uh, none of your business, all right? Don't you worry. You'll pay for that, son. I may have lost this one little battle, but uh, I'll make sure you win the war. What's bothering you? Just worrying about my daughter. So what's new? So why do you need me? You're close to her. I just need to know that the person close to her is looking after her. You know I will. Okay. That's it. That's it. Hmm? Okay. Um, you need some help with this thing? No. No, I'm okay. Wonderful one of those things I've ever seen, that totem. 
Yeah, it's Native American. Yeah. I got it from the Northwest. Yeah, you gave it to her. Yeah. I love it. I think it goes perfectly with this Adams style house. Glad you like it. Can can I get a hand here? I just need you to hold this for me. Shouldn't you be doing this upstairs? Very funny. Lucinda. Yeah. Are you sick? What? Is there a problem with your health? My health? Your health. My health, no. Really? Really. Would you tell me if you were sick or in trouble? I'm not dying. So why are you hanging around here? You want me to go? No, I don't want you to go. I just want you to tell me what's going on. I mean, you're talking like you're sick or something. No, I, 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 that's, no, I'm not. You're practically handing Lily over to me like a bequest. Maybe after all this... Santana stuff. It's just made me realize that we're all hanging on by a very slender thread. You know, philosophically speaking. Right. What's really wrong, Lucinda? Nothing. Nothing. You know you can tell me. And don't try dancing out of it. I watched you work me for years, remember? Don't push me around. You want me to watch over Lily for a reason. It's like you're giving me some kind of warning here. Why? Here, keep pressure on until the bleeding stops. I'm all right. Yeah, you caught you by surprise there. Anybody will go down if they're sucker punched. What are you trying to do, put a wet towel in my ego for me, please? I think my manhood will remain intact. Hey, whatever. <sighs> Besides, there's lots of other ways to surprise somebody. You can just ask Emily, all right? She knows what... Where'd she go? Well, I guess this is as good a place to start as any. the watching. This is my Happy Meal. This is my McDonald's. This is Woody. This is Tigger. T.I. Double Gopher. <laughs> and this is the Disney Video Masterpiece Collection Happy Meal. Howdy, howdy, howdy. <laughs> Just buy your kids a $1.99 hamburger Happy Meal and get one of eight characters from your favorite Disney movies now in video. You're my favorite deputy. This is my McDonald's, and this is Tigger. Say TTFN. Ta-ta for now. And with extra value meals starting at $2.99, everyone in the family can be happy. How's my precious? You're getting so big. One plant food gives your plants as much loving care as you do. Osmocote. One sprinkle feeds your plants continuously, every day, all season long. Osmocote, the plant food for plant lovers. When is heartburn worst for you? After a rotten day at work. After pizza? I really pay the price. Zantac 75 works for me. Zantac 75 starts working fast. Faster than Pepsid AC. And it's so safe, it's got no drug interaction warnings. Zantac 75 contains the number one prescription acid-reducing medicine. Zantac 75 is the smart choice. For my worst heartburn. Zantac 75, the final word in heartburn relief. Hey, let's break for a Kit Kat. Give me a break, give me a break. Break me off a piece of that Kit Kat bar. Give me a break, give me a break. I want to take a break with that Kit Kat bar. Deep clean your pores while you sleep. Neutrogena Deep Pore Treatment penetrates all the way down into your pores to clear away blockages and occasional problems. Wake up to a clear complexion with Neutrogena Deep Pore Treatment. Johnson's knows it may take weeks for babies to fully develop the ability to blink or tear. That's why Johnson's Baby Shampoo is as gentle to the eyes as pure water. It's mild enough for newborns and the number one choice of hospitals. Johnson's. Molly, why can't you live with me? 
I can't, all right? Uh, listen, we have got to... Could everybody please sit down? Please? Ms. Conlon, sit down. Now, could you tell me if there is some reason why you don't want to go to Mrs. Grimaldi's? Um... Yes. She has a small child at home to take care of, and I, I don't want to be in the way. I see. So you would make other accommodations? Exactly. With what? You have no job, no income, do you? Not yet, sir, but once you I You were get unemployed when you were arrested, were you not? <sighs> Your Honor, I've gotten the names of some internship programs where Miss Conlon could be welcomed. Could be or would be. She'll be out on bail. It's going to limit her prospects. That's why the internship programs would be perfect, Your Honor. People are placed in temporary situations. It's the norm. But not very many people want to spend a lot of time training somebody who could be headed for prison. Ms. Conlon, you might have to lie to a prospective employer in order to get them to consider you. No, I wouldn't lie, Your Honor. That is no way to start over. So you'd be honest with them? You'd tell them that you've been arrested and you're on your way to trial? Sir, that's the truth. And I would tell them that I'm a really hard worker and that I would do my best for them. Uh, Your Honor, I own many businesses. I'm sure I could find a job that Molly is suited for. All right, what are Miss Conlon's job skills? Well, she's a terrific writer. I'm Your Honor, sure. I have experience waitressing as a cashier in a daycare center. Look, I know that I didn't have a job at the time that I was arrested, but I had just been here for a little while. And that's my problem, Miss Conlon. I believe you have good intentions, but there just isn't very much to keep you here, I'm afraid. Your Honor, we are prepared to post a higher bond that will make the court more inclined toward bail. Oh, you can count on that. If I grant this motion, bail will be cash, no bond. But I am not inclined to grant bail and release Miss Conlon on her own. If I'm going to consider this at all, it's going to be if you accept Mrs. Grimaldi's offer to go stay with her. Oh, great. Hey, I'm in here. Come on, this is a mistake. Come on, I was trying to find my way out. Is somebody out there? Oh, great. Oh, God, no. No, 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 don't no, no, hurt me. Please, don't hurt me. Please. Please. If you're not taking a calcium supplement, you may be taking chances. And it could take 20 years to know for sure. By then, it may be too late. So which one should you take? Oscal. Just compare Oscal to many store brands. Which has been tested and proven effective in clinical studies? Oscal comes from a natural calcium source that retains its natural nutrients. Oscal, recommended by more doctors. Oscal, and it costs only pennies more a day. Don't take chances. Take Oscal. Imagine a dishwasher with a self-cleaning filter that makes hand rinsing your dishes obsolete. Imagine, too, if that same dishwasher held more knives and forks and adjusted to handle whatever you needed to clean. And if it could do all of this quietly, it would be this dishwasher, Kenmore, proven to clean better than any other. Shouldn't you consider the brand that's already at work in over one out of two homes in America? Kenmore. Come see the innovative side of Sears. When your period's late, waiting's the worst. First Response understands. That's why its pregnancy test is so fast. I got accurate results as soon as two minutes. I feel better now that I know. For an accurate, fast response, trust First Response. Looking for a better way to carry food? Try Pyrex Portables, a unique food carrier system with thermal packs to keep food hot or cold for hours. Pyrex Portables, the way to go. It seems no matter where you go, people are hearing about Clairol's oh. Herbal Essences Shampoo. Herbal essences, a totally organic experience. Today's show, listening to our bodies. My body's uh, telling your hair is saying nice and easy from Clairol with Healthy Shine Conditioner. It works with your hair's own tones and highlights. I don't know what our body's saying, but your hair's saying, oh, yeah. It's nice and easy to be natural from Clairol. No, oh, God. Oh, oh God, no. Oh, leave me alone. Don't touch me. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's Jack. It's Jack. It's Jack. <laughs> 
Take it easy. Calm down. Oh. You shouldn't. You shouldn't. You it's, it's, shouldn't. It's, it's, it's okay. You're all. You're okay. It's not. What's the matter? Your Honor, I'd be happy to stay with Lily if the offer still stands. It does. It does. Does the state have any objection to bail under these conditions? The state has no objections if the defendant is released to Mrs. Grimaldi's home. I just hope I'm not erring in the other direction this time. Bail is granted. And I'm due back in court. <laughs> Congratulations. Congratulations. Oh. Thank you, Jessica. Yeah, thanks. Well, I didn't have to do much. It was up to you to sell it to the judge, and you did. Now, you two sit tight, I'll take care of the paperwork, and then uh, you can leave then. Okay? That's it? I can go now? We'll be signing you out of county by this afternoon. Well, I guess the suit worked. No, you worked. And so did you. I thought you were going to take him out when he said that about how long you'd known me. Yeah, I know, so did I. Oh, you know, you're going to have to check that attitude, girlfriend. I didn't tell him to go to hell, did I? It was very close. <laughs> it's going to be so great to have you at my house. And don't worry about Luke. He's going to love you. I just, um, I don't want to be in the way. Are you kidding? The house is huge. There's plenty of room. Good. That way I can stay out of your hair, really. Would you stop worrying? It'll be fine. No. It's for me. You know, I, I'm really going to enjoy that peace and quiet after the jail, and I'm going to want to keep to myself a lot. You understand? Yeah. I do. And, um, I just don't think I'm ready to meet a lot of new people, okay? Molly, everything's going to be fine. You think you can read me pretty well, hmm? Spent a lot of years trying. Mm, and I was the meanest, nastiest, maddest woman you ever had to deal with. You were formidable. Thank you. Sometimes Lily is her own worst enemy. And she gets into a lot of trouble. I just want you to know what you're taking on. Well, I don't scare easy, if that's what you mean. But you are decent. Take it from me, you can't always be too decent. I mean, I mean, this is just advice. You have to be tough. And if you're dealing with terrible people, then you've got to enter into it and be terrible, too. You'd be one step ahead Why of them. are you them. making it sound like being involved with Lily means going to war with the rest of the world? Lily's a handful. <laughs> I, I'd like to know that you're up to it. Lucinda, are you okay? Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. Then I, I'm, I'm going to leave you to this. So <laughs> just tell her I called. Lucinda, when you want to tell me what's going on, you know where you can find me. Holden, what are you still doing here? Are you all right? Why don't you sleep? I was just locking up. Why are you still here? <laughs> huh? Wow. Um, well, it's a, it's a nice night, and I just didn't want you to be afraid. Well, you can't sleep outside on the bench. Well, I just wanted to watch over you. You can't. This is my house. I have to get used to it. Well, if you wake up scared. I, d well, I will. Well, I'll get through it. Wouldn't knowing that I'm here make you feel better? You have to go home, home. Look, all right, if I get scared, I will call you. You will. You'll do that. I, I promise, and you can come right over. Okay. All right. You're not going to be scared or afraid. I'll be fine. Okay. Okay. It's okay. Yeah, try to take a couple deep breaths. I was just scared. 
Yeah, I can imagine. I, I'm sorry. Here, take a, take a sip. Oh, okay, I'll just catch my breath. Okay. It was dark down there. I couldn't see who it was. Who? Who did you think it was? Emily, who, who are you afraid of? It was just dark. Yeah. I didn't know it was you. But, but I have claustrophobia, okay? I was locked in an well, office. I felt like I was trapped. See what happens when you play with the big boys, Emily? Didn't you learn anything from your encounter with Diego? Hmm? It's okay. It's okay. I'm all right. I'm gonna be all right. I'm all right. As long as you stop snooping into things that don't concern you. Hey, I was reading it. Reading what? The greens. Okay, what are they? Crunchy little corn balls. No colors, no flavors, no junky stuff. You didn't read that. Yes, I did. Now kids can get a free Dr. Seuss classic to read with two proofs of purchase plus shipping. Okay, then what does this say? No preservatives. Kicks. Kid tested, <laughs> mother approved. A callus makes you feel like you're walking on stones. Dr. Scholl's Advanced Pain Relief Callus Removers with Cushlin. Get rid of the pain by getting rid of the callus. We guarantee it. Try Dr. Scholl's Callus Removers with Cushlin today. Taking the best care of your cat makes you feel pride. That includes feeding him Purina Cat Chow brand cat food. Cat Chow has a unique formula of 42 essential nutrients cats need to stay healthy and active. And it's 100% complete and balanced. When Jen ran a fever, we used to run for children's Tylenol, but then our pediatrician recommended children's Advil. It's safe on her stomach. I like that. And can control fevers almost 45 minutes faster and lasts almost twice as long. New children's Advil. I did it. I can't believe I did it. Listen, it's okay, all right? No, you don't understand. I looked at him and it's like I couldn't stop my fist. I had no control, Listen, Connor. I know, I know. It's all right. No, I would have kept going on. No, but you didn't. Yeah, but the only reason I did is because Jack was there. No, Otherwise, I would have kept going. No, you wouldn't have. You could have pushed Jack out of the way and kept at David, but you didn't. You stopped yourself. You are not him. You are not your dad. Now, listen, you just had a fight and it is over, okay? Yeah, okay. Well, I'm not proud of it, all right? Well, I mean, you shouldn't be. So you're telling me that you weren't scared? No, I, I was scared, but I mean, look, it's not the end of the world. Nobody is dead, and it's it's over. It's done with, okay? Is it? Yes. Okay, what about the next time, Connor? You'll, you'll handle it. We'll handle it. I can't believe how that guy gets to me. I know, he is such a jerk. That is all. He is such a jerk. You know what? He cannot hurt us, though. You hear me? I hope you're right. But I think he's gonna keep coming after us, Connor. He's gonna keep coming after me. Oh, he wouldn't dare. He's probably so embarrassed right now. He doesn't even have an excuse he can offer. I don't think he cares. I saw the look in his eyes. David Allen is coming after us. He's not leaving us alone. Hey! Hey! hey. Here it is. One big boy's bed. Oh, thank you. Very much. How'd it go? Oh, it was a breeze. Judge Shaw. Same guy who locked you up. That's right. And he felt bad, and I let him. She's getting out today. That's great. Yeah, isn't it great? You know what else? She's going to be living with me. Isn't that wonderful? Who the hell are you? KFC, we took buffalo wings and got rid of the...